Hey, hello everybody. Welcome to Zebra Studio. My name is Molly and it's good to see you today. Right, what am I going to be talking about today? I, okay, I've been talking about the hashtag um, vote tech ANC, tech ANC. So I'm going to sort of like continue. So it's going to be like a part two. So I, this is just from the comment from this person and I think it's really, really important. He, this is what he said on on on, the twi on Twitter. He said that um, okay. Before I begin, don't forget to like and to share and to subscribe. Okay, my name is Molly, and I'm going to be talking about the ANC in South Africa and listing um, the the ministers and their age. This I've taken this from a, um, a thing, a, a comment that was said by somebody in the on the on the hashtag for Tech ANC vote for Tech ANC. Well, it's hashtag vote. Tech ANC vote Tech ANC. So this is the comment. He said that at 35, South African graduates are considered old for a job. At 67, South African leaders are still working and are being deployed in different portfolios within the government, regardless of age and qualifications. So I'm going to list the age. This is the list of um, the min the age and the names you know, of uh, the ministers of South Africa based on the complaint that this individual made on Twitter on hashtag vote tech South Africa, ANC, tech ANC. Sorry, I keep saying, saying that. Sorry about that. So number one, we have the minister, and we're going to do the age. Number one, we've got Minister Na Naledi Pondo, who is 73 years old. And then number two, we've got Minister Gugile Quinty is 73. 2 years old. We've got number three. We've got Minister Angie Mocheka is 71 years old. Number four, we've got Minister Ngosazana Lamini Zuma, who's 71 years old. And we've got number five, we've got Minister Rob Davis, who is 70 years old. And number six, we have President Cyril Maposa, who is 66 years old. And we have the Minister Abraham Patel, who is 62 years old. And we have Minister Derek Hart Nakom, who is 66 years old, and Minister Nomalinda Mfeketo, who is 66 years old, and we have Minister Beni Pele, who is 66 years old, and we have Minister Jeff Radebe, who is 65 years old, and we have Minister Gwande Matese, who is 63 years old, and we have Minister and we have Minister Gwende Matanshe, who is 63 years old. And we have Minister Senzeni Zukwane, who is 60, 62 years old. Minister Susan Shabangu, 62 years old. Minister Norsi Viwe Mapisa Kangulu is 60, she is 62 years old. And we have Aaron, Mat, Aaron Matoledi, 60 years old. We have Minister Tuli Nessi. Nessi who is 60 years old, and we have Minister Tulas Nessi. Okay, that's two, that's repeat. I'm repeating that one, sorry guys. And we have Blade Zibande, who is 60. We have Siabonga Kele, 60 years old. We have Lindy Wazulu, 60 years old. We have Zweli Mkize, 63 years old. And we have Lindy Wasusulu, 64 years old. And the Deputy Minister, uh, Cecil Matele, 67 years old, and her minister Tito Mboweni, who is 60 years old. <laughs> so this is very interesting. Take it, I'm um, taking it from what this person has written on Twitter on hashtag vote tech ANC, uh, vote tech ANC, that at 35 years old, South African graduates are considered old for a job and at 67, 67 South African leaders are still working and are being deployed in different portfolios within government regardless of age and qualifications. They cannot deliver. Guys, let's just face it. These people are old and I'm not saying all people shouldn't be in power, but if they don't do their job, they should be removed. They are all above 60. No wonder ANC looks like this. This is what I think. ANC looks like he's, all the leaders, the ministers are above 60 in South Africa, the ANC. They're all above 60 and you expect South Africa not to be corrupt. 
you expect South Africa to be the best country in, the, in, in Africa. And you have leaders who are 60 years old. All these ministers are 60 and above. Yet you cannot get a job at 60. Uh, start a job at 60. Or th according to this, at 35, you're considered as a graduate, considered, considered old for a job in South Africa. And then yet you have leaders who are 60 years old and above. Tell me what you think about this. And don't forget to like and to share and to subscribe. Thanks for watching. Bye-bye.